Let's simplify the fraction 25 thirtieths. What we're trying to do is find another fraction that's equivalent. It has the same value as 25 divided by 30. It's just that we've reduced it to lowest terms. And to do that, we need to find a common factor, something that goes into 25 and 30. So here are the factors for 25 and 30. So I'm looking for the greatest common factor for 25 and 30. And it looks like the greatest common factor is going to be 5. So we'll divide 25 by 5 then 30 by 5, and we'll have simplified 25 over 30. Let's move these over here. So 25 divided by 5, that gives us 5, and then 30 divided by 5 gives us 6. So we've simplified the fraction 25 thirtieths down to 5 sixths, and we can't reduce this any further. These are equivalent fractions, 5 divided by 6 and 25 divided by 30. They give you the same number. It's just that we've reduced or simplified 25 thirtieths down to 5 sixths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.